Welcome back everyone to another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. We're gonna continue the story and I think the next mission is with Micah. Yes it is. Let's go. Okay. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called... Hey Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes. I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, Dutch. The O'Driscolls. I mean... I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the Adrisco boys on the road in the town. Things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tiger. <laughs> anyway, somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things like gentlemen. Gentlemen. Yeah. Comb O'Driscoll. Have you lost your minds? You're always telling us, Dutch, do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parley? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's probably a trap, but what do we got to lose finding out? Get shot. We ain't getting shot because you'll be protecting us. It's a trap. You shoot the lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that's slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. It's a chance. You gotta take it. I killed Combs' brother. Long time ago. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago. Dutch. Let's go. You and me, with Arthur protecting us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. Are we finally meeting? I think it's... I think it's Colm O'Driscoll. I think it's his name. I'm not sure. He's the, he's the boss of the O'Driscolls. I'm not sure if that's the correct name. Yeah, I think yeah. it is. Cold. Cold. Yeah. You know, I've been fighting Cold for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Here he goes. Doubting Tommy. Is there any plan you ain't sour on? Well, maybe you're right. Just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. I ain't costing lives here. I'm saving them. What did you say? We had Pinkertons coming after us. Because of Blackwater. And Leviticus Cornwall and his private army. Then who knows when this local hillbilly thing will come to a head. Hmm? And we really afford to be fighting on all these fronts and O'Driscoll. Oh. There is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen, but like I said, I'm nervous. Look, you ain't even going to be the one in danger. We'll get on over there, find a nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah. It's the long one, right? Yep. This one. Uh, yeah. I think and it's that one. And Dutch walk right in to the lion's den with you to cover us. Hmm? Okay. Just keep calm. Because I'll give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. We got you. I will do my best. Oh, my dear and trusted friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. As would. Hey, up there, men on the ridge. Oh, 
Driscoll's from the look of them. I don't like having eyes on us. We're close. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Ugh. Maybe he's right, Dutch. Maybe I have pushed too hard. Got us into situations that could have been safer. I just... I see all those mouths we gotta feed, and I... I dream too big. Caring too much. <laughs> That's my problem. Caring too much? There's no such thing. This is horse shit from both of you. It might be. Micah might be full of shit. Como Driscoll might be full of shit. The promise of this great nation. Man created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. But it's worth trying for. It is worth believing in. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. Try. All I ask is you try. All right, cowpoke. You're gonna peel off up ahead. We'll be meeting down on the plain. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all right. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Yep. Okay, so I'm guess I'm the sniper. Oh shit. God damn it. Come on. Okay. Hey, we're here. Wait, what's that? Is that a bird? Wait. Oh, it's a vulture. Dutch. Is that Quilm? Been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Mm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, is it? Charismatic leader. A lot of heat on us this time. Both of us. A whole heap of trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. You always loved the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? Go home. Is this thing over? Damn it. Sense. Handing them over to the law, it's, I don't know. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fuck the whole lot of them. With this fella Colum right, we can draw them all back. Yeah, true. We're... He's escaping, shoot him! 
Wait, I I don't have any guns, do I? Did I kill you? Oh, not yet. <laughs> no, of course not. Not yet. But I will. Wait. Was that a headshot? I guess it didn't go that well. Finally! Put his weapons over there! Wait, he looks like... His voice is like Sean. The, uh, the Irish one. The one we saved. I don't know. I must be wrong. Yeah, it wasn't Sean. I mean, it couldn't be, right? I think we got shot in the head. Yeah, I think we did. We were still hanging like that. L, okay. That's gonna hurry a lot. Position twist. Wait, what am I doing? It's 
it's the powder right yeah and that's he's, he's gonna be cauterize Just a throwing he didn't have a gun, really. What's he still doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. I can't move. Hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of beef. That's a lot. Okay. Leave Oh damn, I gotta go to that side. And there's a gun. Right, right in the middle there. Okay, he's... I can go there. Wait, can I shoot him? Can I... Can I kill him? Oh, shit. Hey, whoa. Where's the gun? Okay. Oh, it's my weapons. Nice. Okay. Can I just... Yeah, I think I can go. I don't know. Clement's point. Roads. Oh, they're patrolling. Oh, wait. Gotta see something. That's not gonna be easy. I think I can go back and do like this. I'm gonna try. Yeah, okay. There's one on the right. Just gotta check real quick. There's two over there. Okay, I think if I continue heading like this. Can I eat? Okay. I don't think that that it helped me. There's a train. There's, damn it. There's someone there. Come on, I think I'm almost out. Yeah. Okay, I think I did it. I think it's done. Oh, I passed out. Are they gonna capture me again? I think they are. Wait, who's that? Oh, that's me, right? That's my horse, yeah. Oh, I didn't pass out. Nice, I made it. Somehow. Arthur! Arthur? 
forced. I told you it was a setup, Dutch. My boy, my dear boy, what? They got me. But I got away. Yeah, yeah, you did. Miss Grimshaw, I need help. Reverend Swanson. He's gonna set the law on us. No, of course he was. I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, you're safe now. Oh, let's get him to bed. You are safe now, Arthur. Okay. You're safe now. That's pretty. That's, that's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. Wow. I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Well, not quite yet, River. <laughs> Good. How you feeling? Oh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, take care of yourself. You too. I think I'm going to do another one. Those clothes don't seem the appropriate attire for this cold weather. Okay. Well, where is the mission? Oh, it's over there. Bill Mike and shot a mini grace. What a job. Okay. I guess I'll go there. Wait. I didn't mark it. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Where's my horse? Let's go. Yeah. I gotta say, I really enjoyed the last mission actually, it was a, a pretty, a different one from the other ones, you know, we didn't rob anything, it, we finally met Colmo Driscoll, which was a nice development, I, I think, who's shooting, oh it's the guy with the birds, right, who always wants a competition. What the boys are nice doing. Today, Bill. Shut up. <laughs> We've been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job. Needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them and their pen. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seem legit to you, Bill? Sure. Judge said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And... What about Ford and Darfields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, that's so. Yeah, they think it was the Braithwaite's. Listen, I know these great boys have been now. This is on the level. 
We're stuck in the middle of some ancient field. Wait, I want to step on that. Really? I couldn't move. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right. I could have told you. Wait, what? Wait. He's dead. Holy shit. Only eight bullets. I don't want. Oh. Yeah, the regular. Yeah, it was. It was. I think it was uh, the silence. It was too quiet, I, I think. Die. Wait, I'm dying. I gotta eat. I can't eat that. I gotta. I think. Wait, no. Okay, I think I'm okay. Let me just. Yeah, I'm not gonna risk it. I'm just gonna. Yeah. I'm not gonna waste time. Wait. Jesus Christ. You're getting sloppy, Morgan. Do you see that window and Sean scum? No, not that one. Lenny. Oh, it was Bill, right? It wasn't Lenny. Sean's dead. Come on, just die. Return to the gang. What gang? It's just Michael. supposed to use guns in town right Sean. You want us to come out? We'll come out. Ah, oh, Bill. Guns on the ground now. Both of you. Don't do it. I'm gonna you use the my ability, right? Put the gun down, Sheriff. I'll blow his brains out. You wanna join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? Well, really, definitely. Well, I guess our relationship is gone, yeah, and Sean's dead. He was a good kid. Well, 
How the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what? Six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Well, take the boy's body. Hurry him proper someplace quiet. <clears throat> Maka? Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. And just like Valentine, we shut up another town. He was like an annoying little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. What a goddamn mess we are making of things. Okay, well, I, uh, I'm gonna end the video there. Thank you for watching, and uh, I'll see you on, on the next one.